It's one of the biggest mansions in America. It has five pools, a nightclub, a theater, and a garage that holds 100 cars. Wow. <laughs> but the home called The One mm -hmm. has so many building code violations, it's illegal mm -hmm. for anyone to live in it right now. KKL 9's Desmond Shaw has an update in tonight's Look at This. Well, take a look at this again. It is the one, the Giga Mansion, more than 110,000 square feet, five swimming pools, private nightclub, room for probably an infinite number of cars. We wanted to take a look at this insane mansion again because there's been some significant developments recently. This home that Niall Niami built on spec, hoping to get half a billion dollars for, but never found a buyer. This home that has 250 million in outstanding debt. Well, because of that outstanding debt, it went to a bankruptcy auction, and creditors were hoping they could get about $300 million for the home. It was appraised at more than $220 million in 2019, but the winning bid by fashion mogul Richard Sagan was only $129 million. The big reason for that is that this home does not have a certificate of occupancy and may require millions of dollars to actually finish construction on this home. An article in the LA Times says that this home may have some significant co construction defects and also possibly be in serious violation of some zoning code. So it was a big risk for a uh, Sagan to buy a home that you can't even legally occupy right now. This home that even though it has uh, everything that you could possibly imagine, it's just uh, insane to think that you can't even live in it in the moment. Ever, if ever the question has been asked, how big of a mansion is too big? The one may have just given us the answer. Taking a look at this once more from Sky 9, I'm Desmond Shaw. Wow. Right. Well, if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, just write us at look at this at cbs.com.